Hello, Mr. John McGee. How are you today? All right, I guess. Good, good, good. <laughs> well, I want to thank you for letting us come to your neighborhood, Espelin. Mm -hmm. um, can you tell me a lot about how long you've been here? I think I moved here in 74. Wow. So you're a long-standing member of this community. Well, I've been here for a while. Well, what's, what, what are some of the great things about Espelin? <laughs> well, there used to be a lot of great people around. Uh-huh. Has that changed? Oh, yeah. What's happened? What, tell me some of the things. Well, that... there's newer people coming in. A lot of the younger, younger ones, they think they own the place. Oh. Um, do you think that they bring something positive to the neighborhood? Not really. Not really? Well, what are some of the negative things that they bring? Well, there's a lot of trouble, a lot of drugs. Oh, drugs. Do you think that the, there's an active police presence here? Not really. Not really? I do something wrong, there is. <laughs> <laughs> if you do something wrong, there yeah. is. But do you think that it, it would help if the police were more visible in this area with drugs? And, and Yeah, they'd, they'd stop them. Well, they go up and share. They got a task force up on the hill. If everybody comes down here where they're not at. Ah, oh, I see. I see. Where do you, what do you see uh, Espelin looking like in 25 years? Probably won't even be here. <laughs> really? <laughs> Why do you say that? I don't know, because the way they take care of it, they, they don't do much around here anymore. You mean the people that live here, the community? Yeah, well, not really the people. The cops don't do nothing. They used to have a food bank down here, that left. Mm. That went up into Sheridan. Okay. So you're finding that there's a lot of things that you need here in Esplanade that are not, not available? Of, yeah. What kind of things that you think that this community, community would be better if it were here? Well, if they had a food bank down there, it would help people right. a lot more. Right. Do you think that the businesses around here are not, um, that you need more businesses here? Yeah, there's nothing here anymore. <laughs> really? Really? So you have to leave your neighborhood to get anything, right? Yeah, you have to go over to Rocks. Oh, is that a good thing? No. Yeah, you go down to the plaza. But if you buy too much, it's the long walk back. <laughs> oh. Do you, do you have bus service around here? Yeah, the bus stopped down the corner. Okay, okay. All right. Do you have any local heroes or local landmarks here? Not anymore. No? No, nope, there used to be. There used to be a memorial down by the down by the creek. I don't even think that's down there anymore. Really? Why'd they move a, 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 a memorial? Nobody's around here anymore. Oh, I see. So do you think the city has forgotten about Esplin? I think so. Yeah. What what kind of things do you think the city could do to improve uh, this community? I don't know. Well, they could come and help people more. Right, right. What kind of help would you like them to give you? I'd like them to help me with my house. <laughs> <laughs> Do you, is this an older community where they have more senior citizens, or do you have more children, or do you have something like right Well, there the ain't that many young kids around anymore. Right, right. Yeah. Do you think the city is taking care of some of the buildings around here, or do you... No, they, all they want to do is tear them down. Ah, I see. I see. Well, I think this is a beautiful community, and um, hopefully the city will hear your voice, John, and come down here. <laughs> yeah, they'll come after me. <laughs> oh, you're all right. Thank you. Thank you so much for talking to us today. Okay. Thank you, John. All right. All right, guys, I mean, that's it. That's just... That's it. Painless. 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 I didn't hurt you, did I? No. <laughs>